hello guys welcome back to another vlog i'm filming my day today just made my morning coffee oat milk flat white can't start my day without it before i get into the video i really wanted to show you guys some amazing pieces from anna louisa jewelry i want to say thank you so much to anna louisa for sponsoring this video they're not only amazing quality but they are sustainable as well and if you know me you know that's really important to me so I am all for everything that they do. I also thought I should just show you the packaging. So simple. All about it. Like, that's honestly all you need. So I'm actually already wearing two of the items. These are the Rocks Small and the Rocks Mini Earrings. Love them. If you know me, again, if you know me. You know I love like a hoop stack and I love these scaled hoops. They're exactly the same. They're a longer hoop so there's something slightly different to your classic hoop which I really really like them. I had actually already bought these so I was really excited to grab these slightly bigger size as well. And my second two pieces are rings. I've actually had my eye on this style of ring for a while now just because it's just such a classic. Their statement, they go with everything. So this is the Everly Wide ring here. And then this is the Noah. I really, really liked the look of this one because it has that slightly thicker band up the top, which I thought would look really cool together. Is the two stacked together, but obviously you can wear them by themselves as well. Looks so nice. I think it's so simple and like a lot more, it's a lot more minimalist, which I really like, but still making a statement at the same time. This is the Everly Wide. You could even stack them the other way around on one of these two fingers. But I think it's like, again, yeah, such a statement. So if you guys are thinking about buying sustainable jewelry, if you like any of the pieces that I've showed you, please check out the link in my description. You can get 20% off with their summer sale. Once again, thank you, Anna Louisa, so much for sponsoring this video. It means the world and cannot recommend their jewelry more. So I just stopped at Daily Bread, one of my favorite places for coffee and pastry. For any of you who are wondering, Oat Flat White, a smaller, stronger, but creamy coffee is, is the way to go. And I'm always like a hot coffee girl. It's it's winter in the Southern Hemisphere, obviously. So like naturally I'm going to have a hot coffee. But I always see people drinking iced coffees in winter. And I just can't do it. Unless I'm in a really hot room or something. Anyway, Oat Flat White is my order. And then I also got, um, I haven't had one of these in so long. It's, so it's not a croissant, right? It's a, uh... Pan a pan of chocolat, so it's like this shape. Uh, croissant pastry with chocolate inside, but then they put hazelnut on top, and I think there's like a hazelnut praline situation inside. So good, I have to try it now. Like, I haven't had one of these in so long, and I went early this morning, so it's fresh. Mm. so good so good so good oh my god i can't wait to eat the rest of that it's kind of messy though there's hazelnut crumbs anywhere everywhere anyway i turned on the camera because guys i have a life update and now my battery is flashing so that's great but I've had an opportunity to rise in Sydney, and so I am moving to Sydney. Uh, I got a new job there. It's a design role for an amazing company. It's in a huge growth phase. It's going to be a really, really cool experience. I still plan to continue Studio Sobo, so I am just going to be hustling alongside YouTube as well. So it's going to be a full experience, but I just can't wait for a refresh just a really good reset I think would be really good for me obviously living in New Zealand there's this New Zealand Australian bubble so we can kind of travel between without having to quarantine or anything but of course timing it is middle of July now so of course 
Sydney goes into lockdown. So that's the deal right now and I am supposed to be moving over there next week. That'll be interesting. I figured I'm just really torn. I'm moving in with a new flatmate which is really exciting but again going straight into lockdown with someone new might be a lot but the apartment's really nice and I live in such a nice area and I'm so excited. I kind of just want to get there and get, th get the ball mopped get the ball rolling i'm just so excited and i just love the sydney lifestyle it's like i feel it so is very similar to auckland but just bigger and the beaches and all the little bays in the harbor there's just so much more to explore i have family over there and i also have some really good friends over in sydney and melbourne so i just feel like it's a good move and for now right now just because we can't it's still difficult to travel a lot i feel like this is a good little slight change for me but nothing huge you know like australia and new zealand are very similar so i feel like it will be refreshing and a nice change but it won't be drastic like i'm not moving across the world but i've got lots of moving content planned i'm sure i can do a bunch of city stuff once it starts to open up and obviously i'll take you along with like finishing my room um, I was also thinking of filming a video that could be helpful for a like Kiwis moving to Australia but just anyone moving into Australia just things that you really need to check off I've got a huge list that I'm going through personal business logistics just all of it just things to consider before you move and then once you get there I thought that could be really helpful because I just love planning like I love going through all this kind of stuff so yeah I'll take you guys along for the ride it's fun and I love to have these memories on YouTube as well so I hope you guys are excited thank you so much for watching the journey so far i know i haven't gotten anywhere and i started making youtube videos again in march last year so it's been nearly a year and a half and i was supposed to go away then put all my effort into freelance and it's been amazing but i still feel a little bit stuck where i am in new zealand and i know new zealand is beautiful it's amazing like we don't have any like covid restrictions here the only thing you have to do is wear a mask on a train but like that's it so it is a beautiful place to live and i i absolutely don't take it for granted it's amazing but i do need like something i just need a little something different Sorry, my camera just cut out there. I actually had a spare battery in the car, but I think I actually finished what I had to say. I think you guys knew kind of the gist of what I was trying to get at. But thank you so much for watching so far. There's some exciting things coming. I'm very excited. So stay tuned. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, probably both. to end the vlog off but i thought i would just jump on here and say if you guys did like the pieces i showed earlier from anna louisa jewelry if you're into sustainable jewelry i highly recommend you guys check them out i will leave a link in my description box so you can get 20 percent off their summer sale you won't regret it honestly anyway thank you guys so much for watching hit the subscribe button if you want to see more and yeah have a great day guys see you soon